lot of people in our society have no one to talk to, no place to go. They don't know what to do. The purpose of my team was compassion. I'm part of the Cornell Engineering Leadership Certification Program that d is designed to build courageous and compassionate leaders. My name is Saiganu. I'm Kim. I'm Grace. Claire. And I'm Chris. And this is Untold. One of the things that we really came together about was telling people stories who don't get to tell them very often. The people who come to Loaves and Fishes are, are mostly really good people. And anyone can be hungry sometime. And everybody needs food. But we don't just need food, we need someone to talk to. Someone to make us feel welcome. Over the course of the past several, several months, we've talked to homeless people, refugees, students with mental health issues, um, elderly people, as well as other community members. Life's nothing but ups and downs. And it's all lessons you have to learn and figuring out what lessons those are in that pain and discomfort. You just have to remember, you are in control of your own life. We're hoping that everyone who comes will interact with each other and be able to share in these stories that everyone can really get something out of. We have notes that they can write that we'll give back to our interviewees, notes of support, notes of I empathize with this, notes of this made me feel a certain way. We also have donations for two of the groups that we worked with, uh, Loaves and Fishes and Ithaca Welcomes Refugees, both are nonprofits. And we also have feedback forms that people can fill out. I read this book when I was a kid and I've reread it so many times. It's called The Lost Years of Merlin. It's an amazing freaking book. And it just, it, there's, there, it talks about a tree and it opens for him and he lived in it, and it just makes me want something like that so bad. But, I don't know how to open trees like that, so maybe one day. Storytelling is such a powerful medium for understanding others, and it's far underutilized.